Hi, welcome. Simon here and hope you're doing well. In this video, I'll be replacing an HP laptop battery. And let's take a look at the model here. This is HP 15 CS1063CL. That is the model. Now, if your clicker, meaning that your touchpad here, if your touchpad is not clickable, or if you feel like there's a lump on your trackpad, then more likely that the battery is swollen, meaning that the battery is pushing against the back cover and the front. And also one of the signs is you look for the gap if your back cover here is separated. And if you feel like it is very hard around this corner and the back of your laptop, it is more likely that the battery is swollen, is like pregnant, uh, it is time for a replacement. Okay, meaning that you probably overcharge the battery, that you leave the charger plugged into a computer 24 seven and you never remove the charger. Uh, that those are the things that would prematurely kill the battery and make the battery goes bad. All right, let me go ahead and remove the uh, the rubber here. So get a, any prying tool, anything that go in between that rubber and the cover and just remove the two plastic cover here on the top. Next is to get a Phillips screwdriver. Go ahead and remove the two screws here on the top. Some one screw here on the top left corner. And there are three screws here at the bottom. It looks like they're smaller screw, so I'll be using the 1.5 millimeter Phillips screwdriver. All right, once you have removed all the three screws at the bottom, take the advantage of the plastic cover that is being separated. So I don't have to make much of the effort to pry it open. Just gonna push it around. And you just have to pry open the back cover like such. and just remove the entire back cover. Here you can see and identify that the battery is swollen. As you can see that there's a lump on the battery. Hopefully you guys can see it at this angle. And it's very solid, hard and solid. So it's time for replacement. Once you have removed all the screws, the next step is to remove the battery and just lift, lift it straight up. The battery model here is HT03XL, or you can look it up for HP spare number, which is L11119 855. If you're not sure where to buy the battery from, Go check the link down in the description below. I will direct you to either Amazon or eBay where you can find a replacement battery and you can get it directly from, from them and hopefully they'll ship it to you. Here's my replacement battery that came in a box. A new working battery it should not be any swollen or any lump to it like this is the old one as you can see that the lump the swell on the battery 
and this is the flat on the battery okay to install it's just a simple process by aligning the uh, the screw where you're going to mount it on at the bottom here as well as the bottom right have the screw going back in it get the cover press it down two screws here one screw here and three other screws here at the very bottom and that should be it and it's very straightforward you might want to come here and take a look at the clicker making sure the clicker is able to click as you can hear the clicker is clicking all right so i know that the touchpad is working again and that should be all so again if you do find this video is helpful or i'm asking you just a smash of a like button for me uh, if you haven't subscribed please feel free to subscribe and again if you really want to show your appreciation uh, please click on youtube super thanks youtube super thanks allow you to uh, share your gratitude show the appreciation to support my work and support the channel thank you in advance for doing that and do not forget to check out my website and until next time bye now